We're going to run through how to upload a news story with images on the CFA News and Media website. The first step is to load the CFA News and Media website, and we can do so in two ways. By heading to the CFA website and selecting the News and Media tab, or typing the news website's URL directly, news.cfa.vic.gov.au. Log into the website up here, and you can use the same login details you would previously have used on CFA Connect. If you need to register for the site or access lost password links, you can do so from here. Once you're logged in, the control panel menu provides access to uploading news stories, images and video, as well as editing these. If you need to change details of your CFA News and Media account, you can do so from here as well. So we're going to upload a news story with images. So select Upload News from the control panel and then select the first one, Upload Photos with your news. If you've only got text and no images, select the second option, Words Only. The first step is to upload images. So we need to create an album to house your images. So select the photo gallery category that best describes the type of images you'll be uploading and then give your album a title. Then you can browse for your files. You can add captions in here. And when you're ready to upload, select Start Upload. You can see the progress of the upload here. Once your images have uploaded, you'll be taken to the text editor page where you can type in your news story. So firstly, we need to add a headline to this field up here. And then the first line of your story goes into this first box down here. And the rest of the article can be added in here. Basic formatting can be done through the buttons at the top and create links by highlighting the word you want to link and then selecting this link icon here. You can then paste the URL directly into the box and specify if you want to open in a new window. So we can see the images we uploaded previously have been added into our story here and make sure you specify the location your story took place here. And if there's no specific CFA district, select General and then we can select one or two categories that best define the subject of our story. Once you're ready to upload, click Save and Publish. If you notice a mistake or want to make a change to your new story, you can select the little Edit icon from here, or head up to the Control Panel and click Edit My News. Find the story you uploaded from the table and select the pencil icon to edit. Once you've finished editing, again just press Save. If you run into any issues or have any questions about uploading a new story on CFA News and Media, feel free to email cfaconnect at cfa.vic.gov.au for assistance.